Tan, what's next for the protesters arrested for taking over Bay Area freeways as more protesters target companies today that they say are aiding Israel? A South Bay District Attorney's change of heart why he says he's working on resentencing inmates on death row. Now, with fun time from the Bay Area's local news station, you're watching Cron 4 News at 10. Good evening. Thanks for joining us for Cron 4 News at 10. I'm Ken White. And I'm Vicki Liviakis. Boy, we sure hope for a different outcome, but the season is over tonight for the Dubs. The team losing... <laughs> Uh, protests continue today across the Bay Area over the ongoing war in the Middle East. These demonstrators blocked entrances to a weapons manufacturer, General Dynamics, in Sonoma County. The group claims that the company builds ammunition for Israel. And in Sunnyvale, protesters gathered outside the Google headquarters. They called on Google to stop doing business with Israel because, according to protesters, Israel is committing a genocide, they say, in Gaza. Sunnyvale police say about 80 people gathered outside Google starting at about 10.30 this morning. While most of them left around lunchtime, five of the protesters remained uh, until uh, about 6.30. Police eventually arrested them for trespassing. Yesterday's protest at the Tesla factory in Fremont turned confrontational with police having to fire pepper pellets at demonstrators when some of them started taking down barriers. The Fremont police say they did not make any arrests there. And take a look at this, the Highway Patrol releasing this video of protesters who had their arms stuck in gallons of concrete uh, while protesting and stopping traffic on the Nimitz Freeway in Oakland. The CHP says this is part of the reason it took so long to clear those protesters from the freeway yesterday morning. So far, there is no word on any charges that those protesters could be facing. Meantime, in San Francisco, the district attorney says her office is releasing the protesters who were arrested after blocking the Golden Gate Bridge. Our card for his Grand Lotus joins us now live from the newsroom with why they're being released despite being charged. Grant. Well, San Francisco District Attorney Brooke Jenkins says prosecutors must have clear evidence to charge all 26 people arrested, and she says they do not have that yet. The pro